What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the world of Amos. Today, we got another Texas Chainsaw Massacre video for you. It's going to be more of like a speculation type of video, but I'm thinking possibly Texas Chainsaw Massacre inadvertently leaked a cosmetic or possibly teased a cosmetic. And the reason why I think this is that the video that I'm showing right now is something that I recorded at the pre-release party. And the reason why I thought it was cool or interesting was that this is the first time I saw Sunny actually get killed in the opening scene by Leatherface instead of Julie. Because if you played or watched the technical test, it was always Julie getting killed in the opening scene. And the reason why I think that is is because whatever victim is not selected for the match and is the odd person out essentially will always be the one getting killed at the beginning or the opening scene. And I think that's actually pretty cool because it kind of adds to the suspense and adds to like the horror film feel to it where you start out in a group and then someone dies right away and then you start the match with four people. However, that is not the only thing that I found really interesting about this opening scene. So if we go back to previous screenshots that I had from the pre-release party, these are what people believe are like kind of like the base cosmetics for Sunny that you can unlock as you level up the characters. This hasn't been confirmed, but this is what people believe because they seem to be like um, like a reshade of the original cosmetic because you have juice, sunny, storm, lemonade, and then we actually have one more page. And unfortunately, I didn't get the name of these cosmetics, but you can clearly see the colors and designs of them. But if we go back to that opening video again, and we pull back to the this, the part where Sunny's running away, you can clearly see that he's wearing something green with stripes. I think we get a better front view right here. Yeah, he's got the green stripes. So I actually took a screenshot of him running away from the opening scene where you can actually see the colors a little bit better. You can clearly see again, he's wearing that green shirt with the pinstripes. He's got maybe like a army green pants with some stripe pattern on it, and then a brown belt or possibly a leather belt. Here's a screenshot from the front where you can see the pattern on the shirt a lot better, where you have the pinstripes going down the middle, and then like the solid green on the shoulders, the leather belt, and then you can kind of see the stripes on the pants. And then this last screenshot where he's on the hook, you can see more of the front again, which just confirms that it's like the different pattern on the front. So yeah, it's clearly showing that the cosmetic that's in this opening scene were different than the screenshots that I took of those other cosmetics. Now there could be several different reasons for that. So to kind of give you a little bit of backstory on the pre-release party, so we were basically playing on dev accounts and each account had different characters um, unlocked differently. Um, I'm assuming that's because certain devs were focused on developing certain characters or possibly enhancing certain characters versus others. So there's a potential where I took screenshots of one profile that only had certain things unlocked. And then when I saw this opening scene of another person, they potentially had something else unlocked. The only thing about that where it doesn't make sense is because if this is the person that represents that hasn't been picked, Sonny's not really associated with a profile then. So that's where that theory kind of doesn't make sense. It could possibly be like an unintentional leak, or maybe this is like they did this on purpose where they want people to potentially see that there's going to be more cosmetics. Uh, Cause there's also speculation that during the August 18th release that we will be getting um, like cosmetic packs as well, in addition to what would be part of the base game. But for me, I'm a sucker for cosmetics. I think more the merrier. I really hope this is indicating that there are going to be plenty of options when the game is released uh, August 18th. But I would love to hear what you guys think about it as well. Let me know what you think this could potentially mean. It could also potentially be something that didn't make it into the game and they just forgot to, to take it out. But I'm thinking it's more like a tease because Gun and Sumo are very detailed in what they do and I, and I feel like they always have something up their sleeve. But Nonetheless, I'm super excited about August 18th. I don't think it can get here soon enough. If you like these type of videos, please leave a like so that way I know to keep making them. And then also, if you're interested in future Texas Chainsaw Massacre content, please give me a sub. I'm going to have plenty more videos coming down the road. Peace.